George Nye was born on September 24, 1909, in Columbia. His memory covers most of the 20th century, and he has loved the Lord and His church throughout these many years of dedicated service. George came to a saving knowledge of the Lord Jesus in 1921, when he was 12 years old, and was baptized at Tabernacle Baptist Church in Columbia. But he joined Lexington Baptist Church 62 years ago, in 1947. When he and his wife Lottie first came to Lexington Baptist, the church had about 200 members, and he quickly became the Sunday school superintendent. As Mr. Nye recalls, quote, things were not well organized back then, not much of a schedule, and no literature. These days, the assistants have assistants, but at that time, any person just tried to get things done. I got the morning program on a schedule, and gradually we planned lessons with supporting literature. Nobody was at the door to greet people, so I appointed myself meter and greeter, and I'm still doing it. His years of service have earned him the honor of Deacon Emeritus at Lexington Baptist Church. Back in 1943, George served in the United States Navy. He is one of the relatively few who served in both Europe and the Pacific. But his time in the Pacific was short-lived. George says that when the war was ended in Europe, my ship, the destroyer escort USS Ebert, went through the Panama Canal and headed for the Far East. When the Japanese heard I was coming, they surrendered. George was married to his wonderful wife Lottie for 67 years. They built a beautiful home on Lake Murray in 1956, which at the time was the only house in that area of the lake. George has been a faithful and much-loved friend to us all, and he will tell you that he is one of the most blessed people in the world. Today we want to wish him a very happy 100th birthday. God bless you, George Nye.